In order to be involved with theater, I took what was called the jock major, the easy major, which was history, which turned out to be my passion. And also turned out to be the pathway to what I do today, which is write historical fiction on Jewish topics. Why Jewish topics? Because I got to take a course on modern Jewish history, which I didn't think existed, being taught by a guy named Yerushalmi. And Yerushalmi is, until he passed away, but he still is, one of the greatest professors on Jewish history, modern Jewish history, who ever existed. And I didn't know that. I just took this course. And like that rabbi who galvanized me when I was a child, this was like him, I just exploded with excitement. It was like, I don't know, fireworks going off in my brain. I thought Jewish history was one story. So Moses went up the hill, he got three tablets, he came down the hill and he got so angry he dropped them. They broke. He went back up the hill and he got shortchanged and only came down with two. What? So this is what I thought, because every year in Hebrew school, that's the, as far as we got on the story. We never got any further. And then, I don't know, 2,000 years later, we all got burnt. What, what kind of story is that? That's the history that we got taught over and over and again. We don't exist. Not true. And as we all know. And here was Yerushalmi teaching me about our history. I oh, God, I'm so excited. And he just changed my path. And so from then on, I just gobbled up that stuff. I, it was very exciting because he was teaching me in 1969 Right, I was right in the middle of the revolutions happening around the world, uh, the student revolutions, and on the Harvard campus, of course, we shut down, um, but we were learning about the equivalent revolutions happening in Russia, led by Jewish intellectuals. And it was pretty cool. So that was a beginning. 